Hey, so are you a deranged? Are you a hippie? Do you want to read books in a physical manner instead of reading them online? Well, then you've come to the right video, because today I will be telling you how to find books in the library. Now, at this point, you may be asking yourself, Damien, why do I need help finding books in the library? Well, I'll tell you, as someone who works in the library, I'll tell you that there are five floors to that library, and it has the layout makes absolutely no sense. So, to begin on this impressive journey we'll all be going on together, you're going to want to go to the library homepage on the internet. Just look up BSU Libraries and it'll be there. Then you want to go to the box that says One Search. It's, it's this box here. You see it? It's there. And then you'll type in the name of the book you're looking for. And today I'm using Moby Dick as an example. So, once you type in Moby Dick, hit Search. And then from there, you will... Okay, so after searching, you're going to see a page like this, and the first result there, it says Moby Dick, but if you look a little lower, it says online. And remember, we're hippies. We, we want to touch it with our hands. We can't do that. So you'll want to scroll down a bit like that. And then that first result, Hindu avatar, I don't, I don't think that one's right. Uh, there's one there that's uh, archives only and fun fact you can't check out books from the archives you can only look at them so you don't want that and then that option the, the lowest one that's right and that's available and you'll see this little number here this number and it says like PS and whatever yeah you want to take that number and then you'll want to go to the library physically go to the library you'll need a slip of paper like this which you can get at the reference desk where I work if you see me there say hi and you'll get a piece of paper like this and then you can correlate what the little number below the book is that was PS and then you can correlate it with on this paper it tells you what floor it's on uh, P.S. is on for East, so I'll go ahead and show you first-hand footage of me getting this book from the library. Okay, so here I am in the library, and I'm going to answer the obvious question first. Yes, I did run just into the elevator there, but that's not important. I want to point out my biggest mistake. You see that sign there that says East and West? I go West, should have gone East. It takes me so much longer than I thought it would. Okay, after that kerfuffle, you will see me wandering around the wrong side of the library. I'll get there eventually, don't worry. It's just a hero's journey. I, I went through a whole process of learning, discovered myself. Anyway, you may be asking yourself, once you're on the right floor, how do you know what aisle the book is in? Well, the first two numbers, the PS, that'll tell you if you're in the right aisle or not. You see... The uh, and once you're actually in the aisle, it's all numerical. So after it was PS285 or something, and you just start at one end of the aisle and then you go down until you get to 285. Okay, so fun fact while we have the time, since I'm clearly still searching, if you ever feel lazy and don't want to look on the computer for yourself where a book is, you can come to the reference desk, and I, me, who works at the reference desk, can help you find the book just by myself. <gasps> And there it is. There it is. There was Moby Dick. Did you see Moby Dick on that shelf? Because I, Damien Clemens, found Moby Dick on that shelf. Now, once you have your book in your hands, you just go back down to the bottom floor and go to the big main circulation desk and just give them your book. You'll have to have your ID card and then you can just check out the book. They'll tell you when to bring it back and now you have a book. Congratulations. You are now a hipster who reads from paper. I didn't drop that. I think I think I need to go. I, was, I hope this video was good. Have a good night. See you tomorrow.